everyone welcome to programming knowledge so this is the third tutorial of our django series so i again welcome you all to programming knowledge so guys this is the new link of our repository so like uh, we are going to continue with the project uh, like django to do app so basically we are working on the sqlite database on the use via this app so let's get started with this so basically uh, uh, in this today's tutorial we are going to implement the list and delete operation okay list and delete operation uh, uh, on the to do app okay so so basically uh, uh, till the previous video we had uh, made a, a small app so i'll give you a small overview so my server is running okay so i'll give you a small overview so where uh, i told you so uh, like where i told you like uh, we can add a data so i'll make test new okay i'll do a to do title uh, uh, let's new let me add something new title new title new description and uh to do priorities five okay so i'll add this to this and when i move to my uh, uh, database so i'll move to the to do to do uh, to do app underscore to do so and uh, here I, I can see new title new description priority and created has been added with id4 uh, basically uh, uh, and the 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 ones which I uh, added in last video uh, video so I had deleted them just to try out something new new on this so let's get started with this today's tutorial so today we'll implement a delete operation okay so before this I uh, will make a list page so, so I'll uh, list all to dos here list all to dos okay. So you can give any title you want list to all to do's okay so basically uh, uh, what you can do so we'll move use bootstrap here so uh, we'll move to this URL uh, so uh, this will give us the components here so here you can see so we'll quickly move to the URL and uh, we can do what we can use uh, either we can use card okay we can use card here okay so this looks good so so i'll copy this okay but before that what we need to do okay uh we use this was our form which worked fine so we will move to the views.py file okay till here we it's fine so i'll do a, a dictionary my dictionary i'll create a my dictionary my dictionary and uh, uh for all to do's okay I'll uh, render them to the page to do dot objects dot all. So I hope this is fine. So so to do dot objects dot all, and I'll do list dot html, and I'll give context is equal to my dictionary. I hope this is fine. Okay. So let me add a new to do and check. Uh, new data new data new and i'll give a priority as six and i'll submit this so yes yes uh uh but uh okay let me check one thing okay okay okay, okay. i made a mistake uh okay i had uh, in this my index.html uh, I had to put this all under the block content block content okay and here's the form and I'll end this with percent and block this is fine I hope this is fine percent and block will do uh, okay now uh, and here what can i do uh, uh, in this page list.html uh, which name i had made th that is all to do's so i'll do like this all to do's okay so uh, i hope this should work fine now the to do title is new title three new okay let me give it as seven okay so here you can see i have uh, it is showing me query set which says 
to do object 4, 5, 6 and let me check in my data which are this 4, 5, 6 so these are the 3 which I had uh, uh, which I had uh, recently added these are the 3 ok so we would uh, use a list or a card so so what you can do we can use the a for loop here percent for each to do or, or uh, to do for each uh, for each to do in all to do's okay i hope this is fine okay uh, the all to do's this is percent and for okay so so this is fine this is card title so i'll give each to do dot title and in the same way i'll give each to, to do dot description okay each to do dot description so this would give me the description okay and one thing i can do also let me check okay uh, uh, what i can do uh, i'll give a space here and uh, type each to do dot priority i hope this is fine this this would give the priority and uh, uh, we'll come to this uh, reference tag we'll create a delete operation here so i'll refresh this page so here you can see new title new description new data 6 data new new title 37 new new title 37 okay so uh, so i uh, maybe i refresh this page so i had i hit this query twice so that's why i have to twice this data okay because i had refreshed this page so this had uh, made a, another operation add operation here okay so we'll now uh, do something uh width is this okay margin uh, i'll give a margin top of one rem okay and div class is equal to row okay div class is equal to call md6 so i hope this is fine now i'll paste the card here so here you can see here i'll paste the card now and here you can see okay uh let me do this uh, okay yeah and i'll give a style is equal to margin i'll give a margin here margin zero auto okay so i'll again refresh this page so i'll so yeah now it looks uh, uh, fine okay but uh, let me check something uh, so so this is a call md6 yeah so here what you can do if you want to increase the width you can give anything you want uh, maybe uh, what you can do uh, I'll give class to card and container fluid so this would take the whole width of the container okay so I hope this is fine now okay so and now we have to create a delete operation so uh, I'll, uh, uh, so like till now let me do one thing so uh, I'll add a new title new title delete operation okay delete task something like this priority I'll give it as 78 when I add this I get this at the end okay so one thing we are missing here that is the we had made models.py we had created add operation so we'll even add this also so so i'll copy this and now i'll do each to do created add okay so so i'll refresh this page 
now here you can see i have all the created options uh, with the timings okay so this looks works perfectly fine so in the next tutorial we'll implement other features as well so thank you guys thank you so much i'll catch you in the next tutorial